a blessed morning one and all this is your apostle elijah peter chambers once more with a pounding word hallelujah a harsh one and also an intriguing one and my topic today my story put behind bars for speaking thus said the lord and my theme porn to win i have been winning on a constant and perpetual basis this week it was on the news that their international an international organization will be coming into jamaica to process oil hallelujah didn't i told you that oil and gold is in the land of jamaica it was minister vaz who came out saying he knows nothing categorically he knows nothing this is the word of the minister of energy so the feeders are there the news are there so you can't sue nobody it's coming out of your own mouth there is also a young man i think it's um young minister p i can't remember his name let me see if i i see it here uh young p young p ministry he was locked up by the prime minister the prime minister sent police go lock him up again go lock him up so it is proven that the prime minister of jamaica is doing everything in his power to silence the voice the voice of god that speaks through the prophets but the lord told me prime minister of jamaica your disgrace will become worse the integrity commission they have been manipulating you and putting you, all of you under it, order and respect and under manners we watched every move of the integrity commission and you thought that you could have manipulated everything listen god is going to take you down you and your followers, the evil ones, the hypocrites. I said, thus said the Lord. I said, God is going to take you down. The Prime Minister of Jamaica says out of his mouth that he has no objectives to the fish in his cabinet. When the former Prime Minister Bruce Golding declared when he was in power that he will not tolerate fishes in his cabinet. One more prophecy has come to pass. The Lord told me that oil and gold is in the land. A company abroad will be in Jamaica starting, starting to pull oil out of Jamaica. When Vaz says in the news that it categorically no oil is in the land. The government signed the, Sam the Samoa Agreement December 14. 2023 do your research the lord spoke to me to tell the prime minister and his evil kingdom you can't fight god and win you see you all think that you're fighting you're fighting elijah peter chambers are you fighting minister p or all of those that are speaking on behalf of the kingdom of God. Listen, you can't win. And I can tell the, every one of you. You could drag my name on social media and say all manner of lies. Because some of you are on social media telling a lot of lies about me. You don't even know nothing about me. If you knew, if you had information about me, you'd be speaking the truth. But you're speaking a lot of lies. Because when you're saying that I was grown in a, in a boy's home, I was never grown in a boy's home. I was grown in a children's home. Salvation Army, unburied children's home. Salvation Army. And that word children mean boys and girls. I grew around 40 to 50 girls. It was about 100 I had children at that time when I was at unburied children's home. Salvation Army, Kendall Shooters in Manchester. So you don't know nothing about me. I don't have a fish background. All I know is female. 
this vagina me love nothing else and none of you can force me to go into the rear end of a man because that's the lifestyle that you all are living and, um, for the past few weeks I've been getting a lot of calls by young ladies both sinners and Christians and the men are pursuing their rear end the men don't want the men in Jamaica don't want the vagina remember the Bible said that God created the vagina for sexual pleasure that's where we are to go not into the rear end but some of your smell of feces some of your smell of doo-doo your smell of doo-doo even though you put on Isimiaki, Calvin Klein a million dollar man you're still in the spirit you're smelling a doo-doo you nasty man and this is what this government wants the people to go into and then you have the bloggers trying to bring confusion on social media that the other party is in it. Listen, Mark Golden, you can't bring that into Jamaica. Prime Minister, you cannot bring that into Jamaica. We know that you have signed the legislation. You have signed the Samoa law. And people of Jamaica, you need to go and do your research what the Samoa, the Samoa law entails. What is the legislation about? And you notice this government, they have used legislation, changed legislation, laws to suit them. Leader of Jamaica, it is proven that you want to silence the voice of God in Jamaica. After the young minister gave a prophecy to you about God's servants, judgment is near. It will be worse. Your kingdom will be exposed get ready for a fresh disgrace get ready for a fresh disgrace those who have been tracking the integrity commission the investigation you notice they're trying to silence everyone everybody resigning people running for their lives they know if they ever open their mouth they are policemen they are gunmen that is assigned to the prime minister that will take you out and i'm not telling a lie that's a thus said the lord and if god was not with me they would have taken me out they tried in 2020 2021 march 24 and god stood before them with a flaming sword and listen the lord told me prime minister of jamaica there's an angel that is going to stand before you with a flaming sword thus said the lord there is someone in your cabinet that's going to die the Lord say, you touch the Lord's anointing. You touch the young P. You lock him up. You send police to lock him up, to silence him. God says, I am going to take down someone in your cabinet again. There is a funeral coming to your cabinet. There's a death warrant coming to you. And those, that, that group of police that is working behind the scene for you, confusion is coming to that group to that territory let god arise let the enemies be scattered there is a disgrace that will be coming out for that police that group of police that is working for the prime minister behind the scene intimidating the christians in this land from speaking thus to the lord it is proven that you don't want the voice of God to speak in the land. And listen, you can't send a law against me. Everything that I'm coming with is what comes out of your mouth. There's a cock kill mouth. And your, and your own mouth will kill you. Your own mouth will bring you down. Your own mouth destroying you. Hallelujah. Touch not the Lord's anointed and do his prophet. No, I want to encourage that young man that they locked up. Don't let them intimidate you. The Lord spoke to me to tell you, young man, don't let them intimidate you. Young P, continue to speak. No, said the Lord. Even if your life will be taken, do said the Lord. Because listen, if you don't speak, there is judgment. There is a war over your head. And that is why they don't understand all the death threats they are sending to me. The gunmen, the hitmen, 
the who be a man, the witchcraft, the, 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 the scammer, who them send him to kill me, and God take them down. Listen, I will ever speak, thus said the Lord, in this land. And whether you want to hear or you forbear, Micah 2 says, Woe to them that devise iniquity and work evil upon their beds. When the morning is light, they practice it because it is in the power of their, their hands. And they co covet fields and take them by violence. It's a land where this government take off from the people. Eh? Listen, the judgment, the blood, the, 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 the tears of the people are upon this government. All they do is greedily taking the lands you don't you don't you don't see what is happening they're pursuing lands all over jamaica because in land listen the people of jamaica need to understand that lands land determines wealth and money and that's what this government is doing the lord showed me in a vision that they're taking up they're trying to take every land well listen you have to give it back to the people you have to give it back to the nation all oh, the robbery that has taken place and the real estate that is connected, culminated with you to rob the nation. God is going to take them down.